welcome back to my channel. Today is going to be a clean with me after a birthday party. My kids turned seven and 10 and we had a combined party. We went on a hayride. I'll put in some footage of that in a little bit at the end if you wanna see it. But today we're focused on cleaning the kitchen because oh my word, let me show you. All right, so I'm just gonna jump right on in here and start cleaning. I decided to start at one end of the kitchen and make my way to the other. So I'm starting on this little buffet area here and just gonna pick up all the trash and put it in a garbage bag. Big thank you to my oldest son for bringing mom with the garbage bag. That was super sweet. Anyway, um, it's really not a horrible disaster of a mess, but in such a small space, it gets very overwhelming. So I wanted to get it cleaned up very quickly. <laughs> Fortunately, I got to take a nap before I tackled it, so I have all this fresh energy to just come in here and clean it all up. This dish towel was just disgusting, so I decided to go ahead and put it in the dirty laundry. Y'all, I'm so excited. I think I said probably 12 videos ago that I'm looking for some barkeeper's friend and I couldn't find it anywhere, but my sister found it for me at Dollar General of all places. So I finally got some and I'm so excited. I love the way this cleans my sink. If today you are visiting my channel for the first time, I just want to say hello, welcome. My name is Jessie. The channel is Mama Jessie J. And over here, I love sharing motherhood content with you, whether that is uh, day in the life vlogs, cleaning motivation, home decor, just all the fun things. That's what you're going to find here. So if that is something that you like, hit that red subscribe button to see all of my new videos. I can't wait to motivate, inspire, and encourage you in your daily life as homemakers. Um, I myself am married to my high school sweetheart. We just bought a house out in the country about a year ago. We have three boys together. They are 12, 10, and 7. Cannot believe I'm saying 10 and 7. My baby is 7 years old. I just cannot believe it. Oh, it's unreal. Anyway, so I have lots of content I think you would enjoy, so I would love it if you would stick around for more. Out, we can leave this city. Let's drive to the open air. Yeah, the countryside is so pretty. 
I got sidetracked here because yesterday I opened a Pepsi from the freezer and it exploded in my face. Y'all, it went all up in my nose. It burned. And I'm seeing where I missed cleaning up a little bit of the splatter. So I'm wiping the tea pitcher down and the teapot. Well, teapot. The tea maker. And um, yeah, I won't be opening up freezer cans anymore. My husband came up and he said, you're doing an amazing job, honey. So I thought that was really sweet. This new snack organization system is working very, very well. The kids easily get to it, and they're not gobbling all the snacks down. It's amazingly uh, let us hold on to the food a little bit longer. I am still loving my Taneco vacuum mop combo to clean up the floor. It does an amazing, amazing job. I highly recommend this to anybody that is looking for something that can help them get their floors cleaner, faster, and better on your back. Terrible. Just absolutely, I don't want to do it. Oh, I got to do it. I'm going to clean this out today. Spaghetti's exploded. Spaghetti's. Spaghetti-o's exploded and it's just, it's like a food massacre up in there. I've seen the hack where you can put lemon and water into the microwave and heat it up for a little bit and then just wipe everything clean. But all I had was water. So I just heated up a bowl of water for three minutes and it did pretty good um, getting the stuck on things off a little bit easier. So I could just go in the microwave and wipe it out real quick. There were a few spots I had to scrub a little harder, but I was expecting that because this is long, long overdue. I will never again you guys are my witness. I will never again not clean out my microwave on at least, you know, once a week basis because this is just insanity. Y'all should also know you see the microwave is above our stovetop. Well, normal people can just grab a chair and stand on it to clean this out, but our chairs are really crappy. So if I stand in it, you know, it's gonna break. We've already broken two of the chairs. So I'm standing on my tiptoes. My calves are on fire. My arms are on fire cleaning this microwave out. Oh, it is definitely a labor of love, y'all.
Well, I thought I was done cleaning this thing, but then I forgot I have the, um, the glass plate to clean off. So I'm gonna scrub it here in the sink. I soaked it in some Dawn Power Wash to hopefully get some of that stuck on goo off. And I got most of it off. There are a few spots I have to scrub really hard and pick a little bit off with my fingernails. So thankful for those in this moment, but I get it sparkly, shiny, clean, and everything is just good as new. So I think I'm all done. Need to burn that trash. And uh, I don't do that, my husband does, so I'm good. These are just two leaves out of the table that I need to hide somewhere else. That's gonna be it for today's video. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it and got so much motivation to get up and clean your kitchen if it needed it because y'all, I did not feel like doing this. I was so tired after partying. I did get a little nap though, so I can't complain. It's been a wonderful day. Anyway, thanks again for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Be grateful, give grace, God bless. I mean, look at this thing. Okay. Y'all want to go look through the flowers? They are. Okay, I think I got it.